Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to this very joyous occasion. We are all gathered here today to celebrate a unique occurrence in the universe. The matching of two universal souls. It is here in this world that these two souls met, and it is fitting that it is here that they be joined. These entities have traveled long upon this planet and have been brought together by innumerable shifts in the universe to this very moment here today where the physical world may have not allowed such a circumstance as this to have occurred, here in this virtual world, the boundaries were lifted. We are gathered today to join the hearts and souls of Yasso Beerbaum and Pamela Clift to proclaim that this meeting has indeed been sanctioned by the universe. With all of our thoughts, souls, and blessings, we are here to witness their vows to each other. Yasso, do you take to your heart this woman, Pamela, to love, cherish, and cling to, promising to share with her your true and honest thoughts, your heart, your knowledge, insight, and love with her, honoring her as your true as second life companion and working together to share your second life's journey intertwined in love for as long as the universe decrees? Yes, I do. Do you take to your heart this man, Yasso Beerbaum, to love, cherish, and cling to, promising to share with him your true and honest thoughts, your heart, your knowledge, your insight, and your love with him, honoring him as your true second life companion and working together to share your second life journey intertwined in love for as long as the universe decrees? Our couple has a few words to say to each other. Yasso? My darling... Mrs. Bombastic, Pamela, you arrived very suddenly into my SL life. By sheer accident, I feel destiny brought us together. A perchance meeting. When we first met, I really didn't have any designs on you. You were just one of the many women that I had met on SL. Then the conversation started. Your voice, at first, very forthright, very engaging, humorous, commanding, inquiring, probing. Looking into my head, I could feel you wanting to know what made me tick. You did not phase me or put me off. In fact, I found it quite enjoyable. I could feel myself being drawn into a very charming game of verbal acrobatics, found myself reversing the conversation, and I became the inquisitor, and poor Pam became the victim, hence the name Mr. Bombastic, a title you gave me a little later in our relationship. At first this meeting, we offered each other friendship. Let me tell you, I was already hooked on you. Pam, you in instantly invaded my thoughts. I knew in a flash I wanted you, and most of all, your love. At first, your resistance to me was very high. It took a long time for you to love me. But I wanted you so much, I persisted till I won the prize of my SL life, your love. And on this day, I proclaim to the world, I love you. I shall cherish you, protect you, and put you above anything here in this world, you now are my wife and queen, and you will always sit at my right hand forever. My beloved Mr. Bombastic, Yasso, you came into my SL life persistent, possessive, and so darn bombastically cute. You shared with me your thoughts, your weaknesses, and strengths. In you I have found my knight, the king that has conquered the castle walls of my heart. Within this world of pixelated creation, my heart did something I did not expect. It slowly found a resting place and became content. From all of SL, 
you are my chosen. My SL home is not this castle, Camelot, or Planet Rock. It is within the strong but gentle arms of my lover. I delight in your words, the whispering in my ear, and our discussions that get quite loud. I still greatly desire to return to your embrace, knowing I will be safe, protected, and cherished, and where I hope you, as well, will feel the same within mine. I live to give the view my strength, love, and laughter, and will cleave unto you for as long as you find me of worth. Your presence has carved out a permanent residence within my thoughts, which to me, a philosopher, is the most cherished part of my existence in all worlds. I promise to keep you safe in my love, putting you first and holding your love tenderly. May our life in here continue through ups and downs as we seek to explore both this world and the infinities. You are my husband, my lover, and my king, and I shall kneel as your queen. I am delighted to be your Mrs. Bombastic. I love you. <laughs> I love you. You two have rings you wish to exchange? Ash. <laughs> Now having witnessed openly this couple's views and thoughts of love in front of all your friends and the world, it is with great pleasure as a priest of the universe to announce you joined as Mr. and Mrs. Bombastic. You may now kiss your bride. Ah. Yeah. New computer, where are you? <laughs> Hey, you're meant to be doing this. <laughs> Hooray!